Hello everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and also remember to share because why? Sharing Ivorian Spice is caring. Boom! And today guys, oh, oh, it's England 2. Denmark won England through to the Euro Finals, baby. Euro 2020 Finals, baby. <laughs> so beautiful, guys. Oh, 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 oh. I can finally say the three magical words. It's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming home. Football's coming home. Black remix. It's coming home. It's coming home. Tell the world it's coming home. The Euros 2020 is coming into England. Yes, it's true. It's coming home. It's coming home. Tell the world it's an. It's coming home. Trust me, I oh guys, guys, it is beautiful. Whew. England beating those Vikings. Yes, done it after extra time. Whew. My head is exploding. I have never been in a situation like this where England in my lifetime I can witness England playing a final in an international tournament. I'm I, Guys, it's just, it, it's the biggest thing that's ever happened in life in this country. And we deserve this after a long two years, 16 months of COVID, being restricted, lockdown, guys. You tell me, smash a like on that, guys, because we, we deserve it. Big up to everyone, the staff, Gareth Southshaw, Gareth Southshaw, Gareth Southgate. Big ups to him. Everything that he done today, the decision making was absolutely perfect. You know, we are in the final. He's taken the team to the final, guys. It means so much. Congratulations to the guys, to the boys. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. I'm so pleased. Like, my mind's exploding, guys. Oh, oh. It's, it's like, it's just full of popcorn seeds just going pop, 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 inside my brain. I just don't know how to feel. But my God, guys, call in late. It's boss, it's not my fault if I call in late, bro. Or if I call in sick. Because we deserve it, guys. And I'm recording this live and late. Like, not even live. Sorry. I am recording this at a late time. So you better smash that like button, guys. The fact that we went one nil down and it just it was just like chase too much. The free kick, guys, it was exceptional. I have to just say one thing. My own girlfriend, as she stood there, was wishing bad luck upon the nation, saying that the girl is about to score the free kick. And next thing you know, girl, I look at her like, you're evil witch. Mm -hmm. What is this? She's there saying that she's highly blessed and spiritual and she can call things and it's, it's a blessing. She did also say that England will win the match. So, big ups to her. You get me? Sorry, ladies. You thought I was single? No, I'm not. As I was saying, guys, and then I just thought to myself, does England have the balls, the corners to come back? Yes, they did, guys. With Ryan Sterling, of course, forcing Simon Kier to score an own goal. With Saka coming in, brilliant pass by Harry Kane. Saka with the assist. It was also lovely. Half time coming in, guys, thinking, yep, England had the chance to win it in 90 minutes. So, hell no, they did not win it in nine minutes. But they were pressuring, they were pressing, they were giving it to Denmark. Come extra time now. England get a penalty. Of course, people are thinking, not a penalty. Myself, I thought it wasn't a penalty, but uh, it was against Ryan Sterling. Sterling, oh, why don't you love him? He represents, his name represents our country's currency and you don't love him love Raheem Sterling you know big ups to him for winning that penalty Harry Kane missing it I thought to myself Shemichael's is peak right now a, a penalty against Shemichael's I can clearly understand if you miss but thank god he got the rebound beautiful for him to get the rebound and scoring it and from there it was just absolute pure ecstasy guys because why England are in the finals baby Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Guys, you let me know what you thought of today's game. You let me know what you thought of Ryan Sterling's performance because I thought it was exceptional. 
Man of the match today has to go to Raheem Sterling, my guy, my G, you know, the, the English currency, you know, the, 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 the namesake of England's currency, repping the country to the fullest to play against the Italians and fighting on Sunday. Whew. He did it for us. He brought it, he brought it for us, you know. Big up Ryan Sterling for all out the whole tournament. MVP, guys, you let me know if you thought you was MVP. Don't give the match has to go to Denmark, you know. I could have given it, given it to Saka, which you know he gave, got an assist, but that's to go to Denmark. My three lines, soak it in, take it in, because boy, it is what it is. We are going to a final to play against the Italians, the Romans, you know. The one, the guys that used to have the Roman Empire. But now you don't know it's the British Empire do, that's been doing things after you, man. So yeah, it's going to be a battle. It's going to be everything. I'm looking forward to it. Wembley is coming home, guys. It's coming home. If, if, for, any, if for anything to beat the Italians, it's got to be England. But it's coming home. As usual, guys, remember to subscribe and follow the official Instagram account of Reggie Night TV, which is Reggie Night TV 1, baby. And also the official TikTok account, which is Reggie Night TV. And also my personal Instagram account, which is Ivorian underscore Spice. As always, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and share. Because why? Sharing Ivory and Spice is caring. Guys, let, this has been your match reaction from Ivory and Spice. Peace out. I'm out. See ya.